seeking advice. I don't know what kind of advice I'm even looking for here, but here's the story I just feel I need to get off my chest. My wife cheated while long distance waiting for a marriage visa, I almost cancelled but she made many promises, three months after moving here she is moving out, not out of the country, just nearby, and will not speak to me. I've, male 29, been married to my wife, female 22, since early 2020, together for almost four years now. She is from overseas, I'm from the US. When we got together, we always said we did not care for monogamy and did not do much about it, but we were both open to the idea of being open and knew that, eventually, those wants would come about. I was living overseas with her when we got married, but we then decided we wanted to move our lives back to the US and be near my family and have more opportunities. In June of 2020, I moved back to the US, and we applied for her visa. Being apart and being alone was very hard my wife soon asked how I felt if she were to find someone to spend time with while we were apart. I told her the truth, I was worried if she saw someone while we were apart, she would never see me, things might start to change, and she might get feelings, and I was not comfortable with seeing other people while we were long distance. She was upset by this but ultimately told me she would not act on her feelings. Fast forward to the end of August, my wife came to visit me and things were great. We had a lot of fun with friends and family and just on our own. That was until I saw a text she got from a co-worker when I asked her about it she lied to me. Come to find out a week before she came to visit he came over to the house we used to live in, and they made out, and she told him nothing more could happen until she returned from seeing me. My wife then told me she planned on telling me after she got home because she did not want to ruin her visit. She again said she is lonely and needs someone to spend time with and be around physically. I told her I was uncomfortable with this and was starting to feel like my boundaries weren't being respected. She left a few days later to go home. A few days after she gets home I find out that she is pregnant, we had not seen each other in months before her visit it might have been unsafe a few times. We have always said we do not want children, and while that was still how we felt, it changes your perspective a bit when it comes time to deal with an unwanted pregnancy. I felt awful she had to go through the process alone, but because of work and money, I could not make it over there to be with her. After it happened, she became cold and distant from me, barely talking to me for weeks. When I finally have an honest conversation with her, she tells me she has been seeing that guy from her work again. She tells me she does not want to stop and if I'm not okay with that, then she basically told me we don't have to be together anymore. At this point, I was extremely lenient and forgiving because she had dealt with something traumatic and I thought she was not handling it well. Nevertheless, she continued to see this man for the next few months, barely speaking to me. Eventually, she tells me that because she has been seeing him six days a week and is having a hard time affording our house without me, he offered to let her live there until her visa came through. I said I am not okay with that. It was not a discussion, she was letting me know. We had this conversation around December. Fast forward a couple of months and she comes to visit me and tells me she is sorry and still wants to move here and she was not handling things well. That she does not see a future without me, she can't imagine a life without me. She was so sorry for everything she did and promised she would make things up to me and be patient with me while I got over things. Because I love her, and I told her I would be able to get past things if she gave me time to heal and was attentive, loving, and caring. She promises all this from February May. One day in May I got a phone call from her, crying telling me I will never forgive her and I'll never want her anymore, I of course, try to calm her down and ask what she is talking about. Well the thing she was talking about was that guy from her work, got her pregnant. And at this point I was more upset than I could possibly imagine. 
She told me she was dealing with it and she was so sorry and begged me to let her move here still and not leave her and again promised all these things about how much better she was going to be after she got here and that being apart was so hard blah blah. I love her so much I believed her and felt awful because I could tell she was so upset and realized she had messed up, and I would not say I like seeing her like that. In June the visa process is over and she moves here, things were okay at first. I asked one thing of her, any trace of that guy needed to go, anything of his she still had, any contact with him. All of that needed to end, she needed to leave him behind. I told her this before she moved over and she agreed. I told her I needed to be able to move past things and heal and trust her again. She agreed. So when she moved here, she immediately starts working 30 hours a week, doing all sorts of hobbies but not really putting any effort or attention into spending time with me and making things better in our relationship. I thought okay, she needs time to adjust to moving here, that makes sense. But then a month later she got a different job, where she would be working 45 to 55 hours a week. It also just happened to be the same job that the guy from work she used to be with did. After agreeing not to contact him again, my wife texted him asking him about the job. She hid it from me until I saw it on her phone one day. So I am agitated by this, and it reset everything back to square one for me. It was as if it was the day she moved over. I was just starting to feel somewhat good about us and I caught her lying about this guy again. This is when I became cold mean and petty. I call her out on little things that bothered me but to the point where I was just being overly mean and petty. Now my wife told me she is moving out and into a place with her friend from work that she has known for two months. She told me she gave things enough time and effort and that I could not treat her like that, which I agree with, that last part. Nevertheless, I do not think she gave me enough time or effort to heal from the heartache she caused for close to a year. I agree I cannot treat her like that and have apologized a dozen times, but she will not speak to me. She has been home three days in the last month and is staying at her friend from work, that, she has known for two months, and does not come home to take care of her three cats. I'm just wondering if I am in the wrong here. I feel like I do so much to make an effort to make things better and telling her what I need and she just runs off and ignores everything and stops caring completely when things get tough. What do I do? TLDR, wife immigrated here in June after cheating on me for nine months. Begged me to take her back and promised things would be better when she moved here. Then moved here, put in minimal effort and is now leaving again saying she tried. Redditor's comments Redditor 1. You got conned but a lot of it is your own fault. You're f now and pray she does not know you are legally required to support for a decade. Redditor 2. Yeah sorry to say it, but you fell for the oldest green card con in the game. It completely sucks and I am sorry you had to go through it. You can look into marriage fraud cases and see if anything can be done there, but I'm not sure, given the time you were together. Redditor 3. Contact an attorney. Sounds like she may have conned you into getting a visa, which can be a crime in specific circumstances and she might end up getting deported. Either way talk to an attorney you'll need to divorce and protect yourself and any assets you have. I am sorry this happened to you. Redditor 4. I'm going to say this as kindly as I can. This relationship is over. It was over when your wife disregarded your boundaries the first time. She is in the wrong on many, many things. Please have enough respect for yourself, rescind your sponsorship, divorce her, and send her back to her country to find someone else she can disrespect and take advantage of. This isn't love. Her actions do not match her words. She does not care about you or respect your boundaries when you've given her grace for her inappropriate behavior. You're teaching her how to treat you and that it's okay to ignore your wants and needs in this marriage as long as she apologizes and begs forgiveness. If you stay, there will be a lifetime of heartache. 
Is that what you really want? Lawyer up and pay what you have to to get out quickly. Run as fast as you can away from this nightmare and find someone who will love and honor you as their partner. Many women will treat you so much better and respect your boundaries. Good luck. The first thing you do OP is care for that three cats, the second thing is to evaluate if an open marriage lifestyle is good for you. What do you guys think about open marriages? Drop a comment. Thanks for listening, and I will see you at the next story.